Welcome back everybody. This time we are doing Superman, who actually, oddly enough, is one of my favorite superheroes. So, you know, we've already done the, uh, the, uh, introduction, so we're hopping straight into the music. Yeah, looks like I should have started with this one. Feels like a movie.
<laughs> that was absolutely crazy, yes. Um, so, here's the interesting thing. Same concept, but they did something different here. They decided on this one to go with a little more of what is known as a tribal beat. And honestly, that probably would not have normally worked. I'll be honest. But the reason why that it worked, again, because, you know, it's going to work, <laughs> is because of the fact that they had the bass line in the vocals so well attuned. And <clears throat> that is what gives it that nice, solid, meaty foundation. And the nice thing is, though, is that that's not what is fully most important about the song. This is how you can truly tell when someone is actually really into uh, music theory, I guess, in a sense, is because what they were doing is that they would have the bass go with the percussion. They would give you that really thick, meaty, like I said, bass, tribal feel. But the texture came in with the ad-libs, as we know that they are very, very, very good at doing their ad-libs. And that is the texture of the song. So even though all that stuff is the bass, it seems to stick out more with the ad-libs because of the fact that it was, you know, in scale, a very different pitch. That is what gives the song a texture. And, excuse me, that is um, very much something that I think you could really only get when you have as many people in the group as Super Junior does. And on top of it all, all of them are really good vocalists on top of it all. And, um, you know, one thing that I think is kind of a little unsaid about it is that we hear all of them being able to do these really kind of more higher pitched uh, runs in music. But, you know, in reality, they have a very, very solid um, range in vocals. I mean, to be honest, most of the time when I hear a lot of the K-pop music, is a lot of people are generally a little more on the high-pitched stuff. You know, when you listen to someone like, there's, uh, I believe, you know, Felix, that's his name. <laughs> He's He caught me off guard because it's a, because it's a deep voice in K-pop, which is a little more admittedly rare. But <laughs> all of them in Super Junior that we're seeing in the bass line can also seem that high as well, for the most part. So... <laughs> Range, people. Range. So, in any case, that is just insanity. Pure insanity. That is really cool. I can see why a lot of people wanted me to check out the anthems. These are both accomplishing the same theme with a little bit more of a different take. So, wow. Yeah, really cool. <laughs> well, thanks again, everybody. If you like the song as much as I did, let me know. And I'm going to try and do this again, but fat fingers, there we are. <laughs> Perfectly in between my nose. <laughs>